Okay, the most common problem you're going to run into with this type of furnace is you come up to it and the inducer's running, but there's no flame. So you shut it down, and then you turn it back on again, and the burner lights, but then it's safety's out after the trial for ignition. That's very common with these, uh, these furnaces. Uh, because they sensed flame with the hot surface igniter. Now that's your ignition control. It's usually uh, it's a problem with the flame safety control because that's what that actually is, the flame safety control. We call it a control box or ignition control and so on. But it is a flame safety control because it turns on the gas valve makes sure the gas is uh, burning inside the heat exchanger and proves it uh, because it proves with the uh, hot surface igniter there have been a lot of problems with it and what you're going to have is you're going to come to this thing there's no lights on it or anything you shut it off turn it back on it'll attempt to start again it may start normally then uh, if you have more failures with it then you're going to have to figure out what has happened uh, on this machine. If it doesn't light at all you've got a pretty good chance if there's power coming into this board. And if there is no flame or the flame comes on and then shuts down after the trial for ignition then you've got a problem with that board and you'll have to replace it.